You're watching America This Morning, America's number one early morning news. Good Tuesday morning, everyone. I'm John Muller. And I'm Marcy Gonzalez in for Diana Perez. We begin with the wave of winter weather sweeping across the country. Round one buried the northeast in several inches of snow, stranding thousands of travelers. And this is just the beginning. 160 million people are in the path of two more storms. It is a mess again from the Midwest to the Northeast. This morning, half of the country is preparing for a week of snow, ice and rain. Right now, 25 states are under winter watches or warnings, but some are taking the snow masses in stride, like this shopkeeper in Stroudsburg, Pennsylvania. It makes boot sales and uh, clothing sales really good. Uh, gloves have been good, hats have been good, hand warmers, everything. Snow is piling up in Connecticut, where people are getting creative to stay warm and dry. This works because it's wet, clingy snow. So no matter what you wear, it's going to get wet. Clearing snow is not for everybody, but someone's got to do it, even New York's mayor. I have shoveled twice this morning already because it came on so quickly. Today, over 1,000 flights have already been canceled across the country, the bulk of them at the Philadelphia, Newark, and New York LaGuardia airports. And the Super Bowl exodus turned into a traveling nightmare for fans trying to get back home. Right now they're canceling every hour, so I'm not even sure I'll get out. With the weather getting so bad, I called this morning and got an earlier flight. And then it got delayed, and then it got delayed, and now it's delayed again. All right, so that was round one of the winter weather. Round two is forming right now. And for the very latest on that, what's in store? We turn into AccuWeather meteorologist Jim Dickey. Jim. Good morning, John and Marcy. Our stormy week continues here with storm winter storm two of three. It's already forming up here across the lower Mississippi Valley, going to streak north and eastward headed through Wednesday. But the snow that's beginning already through these early morning hours across the plains, the front range, the Rockies, snow spreading eastward. The heaviest of the snow today, they'll be across eastern Kansas into central and northern Missouri, then on to the Ohio Valley, Kansas City. By the time the sun rises Wednesday morning, likely six to 12 inches of snow. Then from there, the system heads into the northeast New England bring a fresh foot in many locations. Northern PA on into portions of New England again, six to 12 inches here too. And then another storm that rolls in this weekend, hitting many of the same regions. And this in fact looks to be the strongest of the bunch. So again, our stormy week continues. John and Marcy, back to you.